Hello and welcome to Amsha Tech. Today we are exploring how to debug a smart form in SAP ABAP. Let's find the ways of to debug a smart form. We have three ways, uh, major ways to debug a smart form. Uh, the first of all, uh, in, if we are using a driver program to call a smart form, we will use uh, the uh, the strategy uh, that is uh, first of all we, we will find uh, SSF function module name and then uh, then in the program uh, we will find the perform glo percentage global init and then we put a session breakpoint in the second strategy uh, we use function builder and in the third strategy we put breakpoint and break user uh, uh, break user breakpoint strategy. So we will explore uh, uh, all the three ways one by one uh, in our practical example on a system. So let's begin. Here uh, we have a smart form named ZS underscore V001. Let's go to it the change mode and. Uh, um, I have put for the first uh, uh, first breakpoint for uh, to debug a smart form at the global in global definition uh, section in the global definition section uh, and I put the code in initialization uh, initialization tab so when the program will execute uh, always a smart form get some initialization in this uh, section so I put of my first breakpoint here after uh, after getting the records from the VBAP table uh, to, to the internal table of a smart form so I put my first uh, breakpoint here let's uh, name it the first breakpoint And after this, I have created uh, a program line uh, program lines after the main window. Here, uh, as you know, the program line can be uh, can be created by clicking uh, the uh, the by clicking on the right mouse button, and then go to the flow logic, and then go to the program lines. So. I have created an, a program line here of just after the main window and uh, I insert my second breakpoint here I name it second breakpoint to debug a smart form so you can put your uh, you can use uh, your own breakpoint at any uh, any step of the uh, smart form as per your desire as per your requirement and but I put my third breakpoint after the template like this I again uh, get some uh, record from the VBAP table and then finally I put my third breakpoint here so you, we can also put by uh, the break user uh, break user breakpoint uh, by using the break user statement here I use my own user break and then Shakir so this is this will be our fourth breakpoint I named it for break fourth breakpoint and then I um, I um, I have to um, execute the um, smart form so then I will uh, explore the debugging mode in smart form so let's execute our smart form I said no so when we execute it goes to the function module and then again I click on the execute button the system will execute our smart form here as I created 
one import variable that is IV VBLN that is a sale order number so I put here 9862 randomly and then execute and then click on print preview button here it is now our uh, smart form goes into a debugging mode and uh, this is our first breakpoint which we put at the global uh, initialization sec section here we can find that the our internal table have the values if our select statement executed uh, successfully let's explore here it is it uh, it is getting a record of sale order number 9862 and now if we uh, press f8 our second breakpoint will be uh, shown which we put after the main window and when we put our when we press f8 again it will go to, to our third breakpoint which which we have put um, after the template section here I again uh, get some record from the VVAP table and uh, put uh, and import it, its uh, uh, its values into the our internal table IVVAP and last but not least I put the la my last breakpoint which is break shakir and uh, if I again uh, press F8 or execute button in the debugger it the program um, cursor will goes to the uh, our last breakpoint uh, breakpoint that is break shakir if we again now finally if we again press F8 the program will run smoothly so here you find that how uh, we uh, goes to the debug mode of a smartphone and the first way to uh, debug a smartphone let's go back to the our smartphone so now uh, let's discuss the second way to uh, to debug a smartphone the second way uh, to go to the second way we have to go to the environment menu and then function module name we must have to know what is the function module name of our smartphone let's copy it the name uh, the name of function module and click ok as you can uh, as, uh, as you can consider that uh, uh, in the smart form we don't have the, the session breakpoint and the external breakpoint button uh, available in the smart form but if we uh, go, go to any uh, any ABAP program uh, via using SC38 let's explore SC38 and then go to the coding so you can see that the session breakpoint and the external session breakpoint uh, is present here for all the programs and uh, if we also go into any other function module function module also providing the uh, this option session breakpoint and external session breakpoint so come back to the a smartphone as we copied the uh, function module name of this smartphone so let's uh, uh, go to another session and call function builder by using SC37 control V here I uh, paste the function module name and then go to the display mode here it is now let's find the uh, as you as you can as you can uh, see that the session breakpoint and the external breakpoint are are present here so we can utilize easily it here in function module so let's find the uh, select uh, our query uh, that that will that can be find by using by finding the select statement here it is so if uh, I found if I want to um, debug the uh, smartphone by using the function builder 
uh, I can put the session breakpoint here by clicking uh, on the select statement and uh, when we will execute our function module let's uh, also give the cell uh, order number again and then click on the execute and then print preview here it is the program our smart form automatically goes into the uh, into the session breakpoint automatically and uh, we can now debug our smart form uh, as per practice which is uh, which is to find the uh, which is to explore the de debug of smart form by using the SSF function module as you know all the program which call the uh, smart form have this as a function module and we can um, we can get go to the um, debugging mode of smart form by using the uh, session breakpoint same as we use in function builder so hope you uh, learn how to uh, the ways of debugging in a smart form and uh, hope you like this video if you like this video do click on the like button and if you want to see more informative video from uh, me so let's uh, subscribe my channel let's meet into another new video till then bye bye take care